Jessica, a lot of people getting ready. That's right. It's very lightly coming down here in shoreline. There's a couple inch inches on the ground right now and on the plant right here in front of this Costco. Uh, but that's why with more snow expected in the overnight hours, people came here to get prepared. Yeah, pretty busy day. People are stocking up their carts like to the maximum. Yeah, I saw a guy coming out with a uh, with like four big boxes of firewood. People are people are really preparing for the winter. That includes this man. Well, if it's going to snow a whole bunch, I'm going to be self sufficient at home. That's why the Vietnam vet and retired mailman spent his Costco trip stocking up on groceries. Yes, I have enough to make it for a couple weeks. But he's not the only one. Just I need a stock. If I cannot go out next three days, four days. This mom of boys who are on winter break has extra reason to stock her pantry. Um, I walk from home, so I don't have to worry about it. But I'm worried about hungry boys at home. No school, so I have to feed them. So <laughs> hungry boys. <laughs> the final holiday shopping rush. My daughter's. Last minute things. The focus of others. I was looking today on Amazon, and uh, not everything you can get delivered by Christmas. But in this time of go, 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 don't forget to enjoy the snow. Stay safe and enjoy yourself. Still, WashDOT recommends limiting errands if you can, really only if you have to. And a spokesperson for WashDOT says that ahead of this winter weather, crews have been preemptively anti-icing the busiest roads so that plows can effectively clear them. Reporting live in Shoreline, I'm Maddie White, King 5 News.